Hey everybody, we are back with another review, and today we got a box from eBay and two pickups from Whatnot. So without further ado, let's hop right into this review. Let's see what we got in the box from eBay first. This is the one I'm like most scared of because of the amount of rustling around in there. Let's see what we got though. I don't want to cut too deep down that center, but I just want to break the tape enough. Like I said, I have no idea what's going on in this box right now, so it was shipped first class in a priority mailbox, so all right. Looks like we got one of my Boba Fett figures that I ordered. This is a wacky wobbler. So we got Boba Fett the wacky wobbler. Very dope. This is a Funko product, of course. There you go, Funko down there. Originally sold for $10. There's a Wacky Wobbler logo. Story of Boba Fett. And here you go. You got a series of Bobblers. Pretty cool, actually. It looks exactly like the other two that I have. Um, the other two that I have, they're in boxes, which is nice. This one is actually in like a uh, plastic, almost like a pop protector, if you would. Pretty cool, though. Pretty, pretty cool. Definitely dope. Glad to have this in the collection. Boba Fett, and what was this one, a 2009? Does not even have a date down here. Here we go, 2007. So this is old, old school. This is, this is OG Boba Fett, that is for sure. All right, let's see what we got in the first box from Whatnot. Is a soda protector. I was like, Woody Woodpecker, what? <laughs> I forgot, so what not purchased, so it's gonna have probably some recycled content, which is awesome. Nice, so we got the Funko Shop Limited Edition Captain Crunch 4,000 piece set. This one is the common, and I don't know what the limited run for the common was, but it's like probably a 2,000 piece. 3,000 piece, 3,400 piece Captain Crunch, which is actually really cool to have in my collection now. That is super dope. There's Cap right there. We got uh, Jacques Lafoot coming in. That is pretty sweet, actually. That's a, I like, actually like the soda rendition of Captain Crunch better than the uh, pop rendition of him. Some of the sodas... Uh, take well with the characters. A lot of the Hanna-Barbera stuff and like the retro um, cartoons, they really take well with this soda uh, stylized nature, if you would. And again, it's got that Christmas Funko Shop sticker on there because that was dropped in 2020 this past year. Great to have that in the soda collection now for sure. And we got one more box over here. Let's move that out of the way. We got one more box from Whatnot. Let's see what we ended up getting. All right. Looks like we got another soda. Is that a soda? Yeah, it's a soda. <clears throat> oh, he's in. He's right here, actually. Here he is. Jean Lafoot. There he is. 7,500 piece. Pretty cool on that. I don't know what the common run is. 6,300. So there you go, 6300, John LaFleur. And I believe the other one, he's kind of got like a black light glow to him because I saw some people hitting him with a UV light and he had like a black light glow, some of his uh, clothes and his hat glows, but pretty cool. We got the little skull and crossbones on the hat and then you got Captain Cruncher. So this is a great video to get both these. Uh, it actually wasn't even planned that way. They just happened to arrive at the same time because I kind of scooped them up around the same time, but... Regardless, definitely dope. Definitely dope to get these for the collection. So, why don't you let me know down in the comments below what do you think of my soda pickups with Jean Lafoot and Captain Crunch? We also got the 2007 Boba Fett Wacky Wobbler right there, which is pretty dope to have in the collection. So, now I have all the Wacky Wobblers, Funko Forces, and almost all the Funko Pops for Boba Fett. So, just missing just a couple. <laughs> And you probably know what those, what those two are. 
But uh, yeah, we're definitely on our way though to, to keeping that set complete. So yeah, let me know down in the comments below, what do you think about these pickups? Which one was your favorite? Do you collect the sodas? Uh, did you end up grabbing this Cap'n Crunch, which is like a secret drop limited piece? I mean, like 3,600 pieces, that's pretty dang good right there. <laughs> that's pretty dang good. Um, for the price I paid for it. And like I said, I picked up off whatnot, so pretty dope on that. Uh, that's where I've been grabbing most of my soda purchases, actually. So uh, if you're interested in some purchases uh, for sodas, go check them out and uh, see the prices on there. Some of the prices are really, really pr fairly priced, even with the shipping on top. So uh, again, let me know down in the comments below what you think of the pickups today. Which one was your favorite? If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. One more content like this. Subscribe for more because I do reviews every single day. So we got for that. Have a great rest of your day.